Mm. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I have to deal with this. <laughs> You know, like oh. a bird sanctuary? Yeah. So. Good. Well, this was what we experienced on Saturday night. <laughs> Does so you, anyone have any idea what that is? All right. So you've given a couple of clues, whether you know it or not. I have. I said that we did not watch Bucks preseason football on Saturday night because of <laughs> that. All right. So when you first played it, you didn't give any context. And I thought you went to, like like Froggy said, like a bird sanctuary or a zoo. <laughs> Early this morning, when we first started the show, I said, folks, I got to deal with this. I got to explain what we had to sit through on Saturday night. Ugh. And I, I thought you had to go through the horror of watching a zoo animal <laughs> laugh at you no. or mock you. Or, or So I was like, gosh, that is a really I, annoying I, bird. You don't know what it is, do you? Well, then you said right. we had to go through it. It was Saturday evening. I'm yep. like, well, gosh, you didn't go to the zoo on a Saturday night. So then it's a person laughing? That's what it sounds like to me. So the, <laughs> the question is now, is this at your table? Or is this at another table? It is not our table. <laughs> and yes, it does sound like a person laughing because it is. <laughs> I can't even mimic it. So it's like not Chloe or Michelle, witch. obviously. Hang on, I, gotta, I told Michelle we'd call her back. All right, calling Michelle on the landline princess phone, which is underneath my side of the bed. So she's got to reach over underneath the bed right now grab the landline and say hello hello say hello all right so michelle are you listening right now no i fell back asleep all right well guess what i'm talking about the laughing (laughs) does that even qualify as laughing michelle it's more of a cackle yeah uh uh-huh it's awful. Uh, I've got th- I've got three clips here now. I got a little closer, meaning I I held the phone like down behind my chair low to get the microphone on the phone closer to the cackler. <laughs> so these were some of the original recordings. All right, uh. that was one. <laughs> All right, do you hear the person? Yeah. So I I switched chairs with one of the kids, and I got close. I got closer. So the first two, I uh, those two I just played, those were before I switched chairs to get closer to their table. And then I took my phone. I, I hit the video record on my phone and held it like toward their table behind my back in order to get the the closer perspective. All right, here's the deal. Chloe, obviously for her birthday on Saturday, got to pick her dinner choice. And Chloe was just jonesing for an all-you-can-eat, shove all kinds of meat in my face experience for her 21st birthday on Saturday night. Would you go to like a Brazilian place or something? Yeah, you go. Bingo. Little little hockey puck with the green and the red. By the way, hang on a minute. I I I took one with me. You did? Yeah, hang on a minute. You stole a puck. Oh my gosh. Got it right here. We went to Texas Day Brazil. Okay. You know, there are two. You've got the you got Texas Day Brazil on Boy Scout, and then you have another place that gets really good reviews is uh was it the Gaucho or what it's on uh Dale Mabry near Henderson in South Tampa. Okay. So you got the other Brazilian steakhouse. So it was between those two places wherever she could get the reservation. So we end up at Texas Day Brazil. My God, that place, by the way, was packed. I mean, I thought I thought it was a cattle call, and it was I mean, I, almost literally <laughs> that, that place was packed. So we go to Texas Day Brazil, and we get seated in. There's a back room, and there's like I don't know, maybe six or eight tables in the back room, and there's this whole group. Michelle, how many people would you say that was a big table? Maybe eight or ten. There were a lot of people at that table, and they were right behind us, and they were there. They preceded us. And, Michelle, how quickly had we sat down when we start looking at each other like, oh, my God, what is that? 
Uh, like within two minutes? Yeah, within two minutes of sitting down, they were very loud. This whole group, they were all yelling. The rest, first of all, the restaurant was packed. It was a loud, loud restaurant. And even in the, the room off to the side where we were, it was just loud. And these people were just, they were like yelling at each other. And this one woman, her laugh was just permeating. <laughs> The whole di- you think it's funny? She has a yeah. bunch of different kind of laughs. Yeah, oh, she does. Well, I I edited those together so you could hear them. She's got and a variety. Then finally, I'm like, I got to get this more uh, in the clear. I got to get this a little louder. And that's when I switch seats. And then I held the phone behind me and produced this. <laughs> that is uh, who's she it's- hanging out with? Gallagher? I don't. I mean- <laughs> but Michelle sounds like an all, what, what like an hour and a half. Oh, yeah, easily. I mean, can you imagine this? <laughs> it's like whatever anyone would say, this woman's like, <laughs> you know, the waiter would come by, hey, can I get you some more uh, bananas and mashed potatoes? Well, bananas a- are funny. Any more drinks for you? <laughs> oh, God, you got to stop. I, whatever was said, this woman was just cackling and laughing. It's like, my God. God, I wanted to, like, you know the big <laughs> spears of meat they come around with? Yes. I wanted to take one out of the guy's hand and just clobber her over the head with the thing. She would have laughed. She would have yeah, thought it was funny. she certainly was enjoying all the meat she was eating. But I mean, the, the, wait, qu- the waiter even commented. Oh, yeah. Tell, tell everyone what the waiter said. So he was doing something at the little, like, I don't know, the little station behind us where they have some supplies or whatever, and the woman started laughing, and he gave Chloe a look, and it was like... He kind of said, um, he said, oh, my gosh, if you guys can hear yourselves or something yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Well, he said that twice. We were, yeah, because we were talking, and I guess maybe he heard what we were talking about, and he was like, yeah, if you can hear yourselves. <laughs> oh, noxious. So the, okay. the waiter even commented on her, and then when it was time to pay the bill, the waiter was really kind of good. The waiter was good. Oh, he was awesome. And, yeah, the, the server was really good, very attentive. I, I don't know his name, but he kind of had like a – Kind of a hipster haircut. It was a younger, younger guy. Okay. And he was a good waiter. And then at the end, uh, he when I paid the check and I, I, I he gave me the bill back. He said, "Guys, I, I hope you hope you enjoyed yourself this evening. I hope you were able to hear yourself have a conversation, <laughs> hear yourself think, or something to yeah. that effect." Because of <laughs> uh, now, if, if you- anyone knows who that is, call us up 800-990-1047. Oh, if anyone knows who this woman is. I mean, how funny is a person she was eating dinner with? Well, that's what I'm saying. Describe there were 10 her. people at the okay, table. Go so ahead. There were 10 people at her table. Yeah. Do you think that the, the eight other couple, or no, five other couples or four other couples are like, you know, I really want to invite, let's say her name is Deb. I really want to invite Deb, but I don't know if we can get through the meal with that laughter. Like, no. that has to you know be what? something. That's exactly what I was thinking. I was like, oh my gosh, how are those people with her? Like, are they are they with them all the time? How can right. They, they, how can they even hear anything after they go home that night? So, I mean, they probably had hearing damage. Because it is completely yeah. reasonable to go to dinner with four or five other couples and have there be people in the group you've never met before. So at the Brazilians, oh. no. no. Well, right. I, I, you know, I nope. think I think they might have known each other, but it, it, the, but the question is, and Roxanne, you're right, and Michelle, same thing. It's like. If these people know each other, I can't believe that this is a one-off. She must be like this all the time. Who <laughs> wants to go to dinner with this? Right. <laughs> I mean, the whole damn meal. So the way that the Brazilian steakhouses work <laughs> is you get, you know what? I, we used to love Boy Zhao. Remember Boy Zhao on, on yeah. Boy Scout right across from the mall? Mm-hmm. Boy Zhao was incredible. They were there before Texas Day Brazil. Or actually, I think Texas Day Brazil might have opened up toward the end of okay. Boisel. But what you do at the at the Brazilian steakhouses, you get the little chip. You get a little, and it's like the... Is the, that cardboard? Well, this one's just like a paper stuff. Yeah, it used to be much more substantial. Yeah, I think so. Like a poker chip. Well, I've had one before that would look like a chess piece, and it was two sides. Ooh. It was very fancy. So we have the opportunity to... Let the servers know who walk around with the meats. We have the opportunity when you're at a Brazilian steakhouse to let them know if you want to keep going or if you want to stop. Do you want them to come to your table with the latest selection? So if you want the latest selection, they bring it around. You got to make sure that your little chip is green. 
So you've got a green side, and then you've got a red side. I'm holding it up, by the way, on MJ TV right now. I'm holding up the Texas Day Brazil. Uh, uh, Sim por favor, yes, please, more, the green side. Okay. And then the other side is... And we know how we all, we all oh, get oh, how oh, Brazilian but, steakhouses but, work. So red, red, green. Even if I've never been uh, before, I got the uh, concept. Here's what I <laughs> here's what I wanted to do. I wanted to take like some duct tape and take the take the red side and just take a, <laughs> smack it right <laughs> on her face. <laughs> I want. I wanted to take the red side and just just glue it to her face over her mouth. How did you not have a confrontation with this woman by just saying <laughs> something by walking by the table like, well, "Oh my God, the funniest person in the world must well, be sitting here well, yeah. me, because let, you are cackling a storm." Uh, let me answer the question. By the way, I did hold up the little little green red little thing up on MJ TV. And folks, if you don't know, every morning the MJ Morning Show is live on TV. MJ TV. We've got cameras in the studio. You can watch us do the radio show. So if you go to MJ, if you go to uh, MJMorningShow.com and then click on MJ TV, you can watch us live, or you can watch the replay anytime after the show. You can watch the the entire show. So Festa, that's a good question. I mean, the way I would the way I would have done it is I would have stood at the table and just looked at everybody. And waited for them, and it started laughing, I, I, and then they, no, they, they all I, give you a strange look I, and say, "Well, well, this bitch over here is just cackling up a storm." I, I, That's la- language. Okay, well, hold, language. What would you use to describe I, her after an hour well, and a half? All right, here's the deal. So it was getting annoying after like the first two minutes. <laughs> I mean, seriously. All right, all right. So I don't know, maybe fifteen or twenty minutes in, oh, and, and hearing this woman. <laughs> At, at the dinner table at Texas Day Brazil, across from us, uh, I, I, Chloe's looking at me, and I go to like like push off, like push my chair back, like, and Chloe's like, "Daddy, no, please, please, please." <laughs> so Chloe's big, "Daddy, don't make a scene, Dick." Don't make a scene. And then Chloe's like, "It's my birthday. It's my birthday. Don't don't say anything." Don't. So Chloe was begging me not to confront the cackler. <laughs> MJ, the move is... I wanted them to take her and put her on the grill in the back. Oh, my God. (laughs) Why don't you always just go, excuse me, ma'am, and then hold up the red side. Everybody to her. Stop, (laughs) stupid. Yeah, <laughs> or, or start a chant. Like get all the tables together and chant. Shut, shut up, up, shut up, shut up. Shut up. Maybe what? she was, she sounds like she was high on mushrooms yeah. or something. Yeah. How, how how drunk was she? What was she? Did you get any other clues? Listen, all good questions. I just lost my. What, what did I do? Was she my... having dinner with Sebastian Maniscalco? I mean, seriously, the funniest guy out there. I mean, was, was with Steve Harvey at her table, just I, laughing hey, up the storm. I, I just lost my card. What the hell did I do with it? Yeah, MJ. Oh, here I put it back in my wallet. You could yeah. have, in the time it took you to have dinner, call me. I could have made it down there and just like spilled a whole drink on her. So or I should have. Oh. I should have just Oops. held the red side up and said, "Stop." Yeah, for so, real. It, like mid cackle, like <laughs> stop. There you <laughs> just go. Stop. Okay. That's it. My passive, no, my <laughs> aggressive, aggressive way of letting other tables know they're being obnoxious, which I look right at them and do what they're doing. Like get really close and just. Right at their uh, table, so oh, they all start. They, they, they snap out of their trance. So I should have turned around and just went. <laughs> yeah, d- <laughs> the whole your whole table should have had like a a squawking. <laughs> is it a toucan? Would that be the bird frog? Maybe I don't so. know. But squawk- what are you asking me for? Because my nose. Because I know you like birds. Okay. Yes, it is a toucan. They squawk. <laughs> yeah, but you know, just the whole table making a ruckus. 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 No, no, it's a ruckus. Nonetheless, no, I'm ruckus. telling you, you're regressing in your language skills. Something's going on with you. I oh, aren't. Uh, <laughs> he not is Michelle, good. anything else to add? No. Happy birthday, Chloe. Yeah, All Chloe's right. 21. Yay. So a couple of questions, Michelle. Yep. Yeah. How much meat did Chloe eat? Oh, you'd be surprised. I go could pack away some meat, okay. let me yeah. tell you. And there's so many varieties, and it's all mixing in your it's stomach so, together. So much. All right, <laughs> second question. 21st uh-huh. birthday. This is a big occasion. Did she get yeah. boozed up? Did she get drunk on Daddy's dime? No, not necessary. We had one one delicious cocktail, and that was really it. 